Hey everybody, I hope that you're having an amazing week so far. Happy Tuesday. So I wanted to just jump in here and um, I know that we kicked this event off um, hard and fast and it's super exciting to see the response, right? Every single time more and more consultants were like raising their hand and tagging you guys, I was like, wow, there is a need here, right? There's a need for this here. And I'm just so, so excited about it. So I want to just give like a huge thank you so much to, um, to Noel and Ruthann and Kate, um, specifically and Stephanie, um, for kind of like being the bigger pieces of getting this event up and running. I know Kate on a regular basis, you know, is so gracious and putting these events together and sharing that resource. Ruthanna and Noel have been doing large scale block parties with their teams and their organizations for a little while now. Um, and I'm so excited that they, um, you know, are, are sharing with us and allowing us all to kind of come in and learn, see what they do, how they do it, um, and bring our teams along for just like such an amazing opportunity. And Stephanie took Kate's amazing party and put it into a Google Doc. <laughs> so it was going to be easy for all of us to sign up for our slots and um, kind of have that conversation. So huge thank you to you guys for um, just your time, your generosity, and um, sharing what you're so good at with the rest of us. We are like so, so grateful. So I wanted to um, just run through a handful of things for a few reasons. You know, one, I want to thank you guys for coming and I want to thank you guys for showing up. Um, like I said, I know this kicked off hard and fast. Um, Noelle and I had plans of starting this conversation with you guys on uh, Thursday, Friday, and then we both got hit with that gnarly, gnarly storm and just like so many things, right? Just so many things. So um, it just, uh, we, we, I lost power. She had, you know, some stuff going on at home from the storm as well. Um, and everything kind of got back to normal on Monday. So instead of deciding like, okay, let's, you know, um, push this off. It's like, no, the time is now, the need is now, let's just go and do it. And you know what, you guys are, um, you guys are all awesome. You guys are all smart. You guys are able to just jump in um, and and get moving on things, which is just like, just so amazing. Just so amazing. So I know it started hard and fast. I wanted to give you a little background as to why. <laughs> um, and just thank you for, um, and, and just say that we appreciate, you know, your willingness to, you know, jump in with two feet, even though you don't necessarily know exactly what you're jumping into, um, but your teams are so excited. They're bringing people already. It's been so fun to see that group grow. So, okay, let's chat about um, something. This, what we're doing has literally never been done before in the history of Lemongrass Spa. Now we have seen larger companies, well I've seen larger companies do this on a large scale, right? Where they are doing events with dozens of leaders and their organization um, that are huge, right? Like thousands of people in these events and it has been, it's been amazing to be a part of that. And so, you know, when I got to learn from Ruthanna Noel um, in April and they allowed me to bring my team and the response I got from my team um, was just huge. It was like, oh my gosh, like we have to do this with everybody. Like we have to, like now is the time, right? We have been working towards more collaboration. Many hands make light work for so long in the organization. Um, well, not so long, but like the last year, year and a half, almost two years, right? Um, that this is almost this like really cool opportunity to full blownsies put that into play. But I wanted to just address the fact that this is brand new to us. This is brand new um, to us as a company. This is brand new to us as an organization. You guys know we're known as the trailblazers, you know? <laughs> we're the trailblazing organization. We try the things out. We we get the big ideas, the big 80,000 foot visions, and we run through it, right? We run towards it, and that is something that we are known for and that we excel at. So just so excited that you guys are here. But with the idea that this has never been done before, we have even Ruthanna and Noel have not done it on such a large scale, right? Um, so let's keep in mind that this has never been done before. This has never been done before. Um, and so with that, you know, I want to encourage you to come into this kind of leave what you have done with your own mega prize parties, with your own team events, with your own block party experience. I wanna encourage you to take that information out of your brain and set it and leave it at the door and come to this with a brand new lens. Soak up, have an intentional time, you know, soak up what, um, soak everything up, learn, have some grace because this hasn't ever been done before and get excited because your team is so excited. So we're just, yeah, just cannot wait. Um, Okay, so a couple housekeeping things. One, please, please, please um, send Noelle your pictures of your prizes 
and the prices associated with them today. She is taking, I mean, dozens of things and putting them into um, graphics for us to share. And, you know, we all, we want to respect her time and we want to respect, you know, her ability to do that. So please send her that today so she can um, kind of get on with the rest of her week and we can start advertising what those prices are. That would be immensely um, helpful for you to do all of that today, please. Um, you just need to snap a picture of each item individually. Um, that's clear, not blurry. Um, it can be lemongrass products. It can be non-lemongrass products, okay? It does not matter what it is. You can scroll up and actually see um, what other people have donated at any different price point, um, whatever you guys have kind of hanging out in your gift closets, right? If it's all products, great. If it's a mixture of products and other things, also great. Um, we do want to ask you, please don't send samples. Um, just that's just not really what we're doing here. So if you could um, not send samples, but send something else, if affordability is an issue, let's chat. But there are, you know, a $5 gift card would be amazing. A $5 Amazon Starbucks gift card, something like that. Totally acceptable, right? We can add those things into different price packs, but please make those decisions and get those sent to her today so we can be respectful of um, Noelle and her time. Um, we're going to ask you, please take five minutes and sign up for your three scheduled posts by tomorrow night. Um, by by tomorrow night would be immensely helpful. Um, I did my three earlier today and it took me about 10 minutes to pick the posts I wanted to do to grab before and after pictures, which you don't even have to do, but I just wanted to, um, to grab some photos and then to actually copy paste and schedule it on my appropriate days. So this is not something that should be time consuming. Please don't let this take up your time because you want to make it look a different way or sound a different way. Um, let's just execute this fast, right? You can add your own spin to it. Do what you want with that. You can add your own photo. You can grab some before and after testimony but let's keep it simple, right? Keep it simple, sweetie. <laughs> kiss. <laughs> let's kiss it. Um, sign up. We're asking you to only sign up for three posts right now. Okay. Please only sign up for three posts. I think I mentioned we have over 20 leaders. So this is important to only sign up for three for a few reasons. One, um, let's share. <laughs> we want to share. Okay. We want to make sure that each team member has an opportunity to see their leader showing up in this space for them. We want every team member, every consultant to see their leader. And if you take 10 posts, um, you know, then that means that two other people are not possibly going to get an opportunity to be seen by their team, right? Um, also, many hands make light work. We want to share the load. Um, so let's keep it simple, right? Keep it simple, sweetie. Um, sorry, I'm looking over here to make sure I don't forget anything. Oh, another housekeeping thing. We have a consultant coaching chat. Now there are a lot of consultants in there, right? There's a lot of consultants in there. And so I'm going to ask, we're going to ask, um, please allow Noelle, Ruthann, myself, and Stephanie um, to address questions in the consultant chat. If you, you know, again, this has never been done on such a large scale. So I we really wanna just like reiterate and encourage you to leave what you have experienced with team parties and block parties at the door, because this is something new. Have that, I am brand new lens, right? I am, a, it doesn't matter how long you've been a leader, how many team parties you've done, let's have this I am brand new lens so that we can learn something new together. So if you could let us address questions in the chat, that would be so helpful because it is such a large scale event. We can keep the conversation a little bit controlled. Um, we can keep the execution clean, clear, and on track for such a large event. Um, because there is a template to follow there, you know, there, there are, there are checklists and things like that, um, that, that conversations are being based off of to make sure that everything is touched. And we don't want to say one thing based off of our experiences before, and then actuality there's, there's a different answer, right? Um, and we don't want to have to like go back and forth and have that conversation in a consultant coaching chat. So if you have a question about something, please use this leaders chat or you can message me directly. I promise Noelle that I would um, handle the leader conversation side of things and she's going to focus mainly on the consultant side of things, okay? Um, so just kind of how we're working together to navigate such a large scale event with so many people. Um, but that would be so, so helpful if you could help us with that. Um, so a few ideas, right? A few ideas. Okay, well, like, what else can I do? Because some of you are like, I want to do the bare minimum, which is amazing, right? Which is your three posts um, and your prize donations and pop in there once a day and do a couple comments, do a couple engaging things, um, and you're good to go, right? Some of you are like, I want like all hands and I want to be all in, right? I want to I wanna show up every single day. What else can I do? Here are some ideas. Here are some things that you can do with your team. 
The beautiful thing of many hands light work is that the goal here is that you have more time in your life to enjoy <laughs> and not work, but also that you have more time to connect with your consultants. Instead of doing busy work, instead of having to do the housekeeping, the behind the scenes, you have an incredible opportunity, you guys, to take a fraction of the time that you would be spending doing a whole event by yourself and just connect with your teams, right? Get to know them a little bit better. Um, have more intimate conversations with them. So here's a few ideas for you. One, have a smaller chat with your core team members and connect and support them on a smaller scale, right? This is a great opportunity to build some team community and team connection. Um, when you have a smaller group of people who are working towards a common goal, more connection can happen, more conversation can happen, and you've got team members who are joining who are like, in it, right? They're in it to win it. So let's get them connected with each other and let's get them extra connected with you. You can come up together with a team mission, right? You guys know we're doing a give back event with this. So maybe you and your team are going to decide, okay, we as a team want to do X, Y, Z. Come up with a team goal for, you know, the three, five, 10, 20 of you who are participating in this event. What is the team goal? Do you want to, um, you know, maybe pick off of the list that was posted in the in the coaching chat, right? See what is so exciting for that. See for them. See what they are um, engaging with. See see what is resonating with them specifically. Ask them what they want the goal to be, right? And then you get to come in and support that. That is going to give them so much. They're going to be so empowered. They're going to be so much more attached, right? When you get to come in and say, "All right, look at this list. What do you want to do?" Let's go. I'm here. I'm here to support you. I'm here for you. This isn't what you want to do as a leader, right? This is about what they want to do. And you can do that in a smaller team connection chat. Um, do you have any teachers on your team? This is a great way to get some engagement and conversation in, in your chat or um, with your own team. Do an email, do a text, ask who on the team is a teacher. Okay, maybe they have checked out because they're not here for the business, but oh my gosh, I've actually had numerous people jump in, customers, um, you know, team members, and people who I've never done business with before because I am talking specifically to who is a teacher. I wanna hear from you and I want to share a few ways I might be able to support you. You may have people kind of rise up from the ashes, right? People who you thought were long gone, um, who are going to come up and want to have a conversation with you. So I want to encourage you to um, ask that question. Who are teachers on your team? Or maybe they have a sibling who's a teacher, a spouse who is a teacher, a family member or close friend who's a teacher. This is a great opportunity for them to grow their network, for you to share love and grass spa. And again, the work is already being done, right? Um, another fun thing is core team incentives, right? Maybe you're gonna come up with and encourage them. Don't tell them what the incentive is. Ask them, what should our goal be? What should an incentive be? What sounds fun and exciting to you guys, right? Um, have, I mean, all about the connection. It's all about the connection. So um, last note, have so much fun, <laughs> okay? Have so much fun. Um, we're gonna have a lot, I'm gonna have a lot of fun and I want you to come and have a lot of fun with us. So. Grace and I are going to be heading out soon, um, but we're just gonna be watching her friends compete for like the next four and a half hours, and then she goes. Um, so I would love to answer your questions in the chat. I would love for you to like at least react to this post when you have seen it. Please let us know um, You know, if you have any questions. If any of this is not attainable for you, if you do not have the the you know 10 minutes to spare over the next day to you know do a couple of posts or something like that, um, just please communicate that so we um, aren't feeling like you know we have to track or find or you know what I mean, whatever. We'd love to just have open communication about that. Um, if you have any questions, send it to me um, in the chat or send me a private message. I'm here to help. Um, yeah, we're going to have a great time. So thanks for checking this out. Thanks for taking 15 minutes of your day to chat with me here about some of this housekeeping stuff. Um, let's party. Let's party. All right. I'll talk to you guys later. <laughs>